Hey guys, welcome back to my channel where I talk about the NWSL, women's soccer, just soccer, only soccer. Before I begin, I just want to thank you all for watching, subscribing, and leaving likes on my videos. I really appreciate it. My channel has been growing, which is awesome. If you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button and leave a like. Again, I really appreciate it and I'm really grateful to all of you. Anyway, on to the main video. In this video slash podcast, I'll be discussing the Frauen Bundesliga regular season match between Vafel Wolfsburg and SGS Essen. Vafel Wolfsburg are coming off of a 4-0 win against SC Freiburg, while SGS Essen are coming off of a 4-0 win against FC Köln. I'm hoping Wolfsburg can come away with a win in this one. They did really well in their match against Freiburg. The only thing I kind of had an issue with was Wolfsburg's lack of awareness and alertness when it came to Freiburg's counterattacks and transitions. I noticed every now and then Wolfsburg would get caught in transition. Players in the back line would be so far upfield, they and the rest of the team would have to rush back to their box when Freiburg would launch their counterattack or be in the middle of transition. When it comes to this match against Essen, I want to see more consistent defending from Wolfsburg, more alertness and awareness from Wolfsburg. Again, they did all right in the match against Freiburg. The backline and defense is definitely improving, and I think that is something Wolfsburg should continue to work on as the season progresses. I also want to add the Champions League draw took place on Friday, February 10th, and Wolfsburg will be facing PSG in the quarterfinals. If that isn't a sign that we need to have a solid back line, I don't know what is. <laughs> While I believe Wolfsburg needs to work on their defense, I don't think they should neglect their attack and midfield at all. I would like to see Tavea Vosmut, Yula Brand, or Svendis Jonsdottir start in this match. Like in the match against Freiburg, I think Wolfsburg should try to go for more speed in the attack. Vosmut, Brand, and Jonsdottir are quick players who can provide great service in the attack. They can also score goals as well, which is good and always needed. <laughs> Not only that, Brand and Jonsdottir, and I think Vosmuth have really great defending ability and can support the backline in defense when it's needed. Jill Roard, I believe, is out right now due to a foot injury, so we're needing Vosmuth, Brand, and Jonsdottir to step up more than usual. <laughs> As for strikers, Pop and Pyor, always reliable strikers. Also want to add, Obi and Dominique Jensen are also going to be out for this game because of illness. Get well soon, you two. But we should still be okay, though. Huth or Pop can drop to the midfield with Latvine, and then we can put in Vosmut Bran or Jan Stottier. The attack and midfield players are pretty versatile and flexible. As for Jansen, Hagering, and Henrik as center backs, then Rauch, Wiedemeyer, or Wilms as right slash left backs. That's how I would do it, but let's get into the lineup to see what Tommy Stroot would do. So for the lineup, 4-2-3-1 or 4-3-3, maybe. We have Merle Fromms in the goal for defenders Lynn Wilms, Kathy Henrik, Feli Rauch, and Marina Hagering. In the midfield in attack, we have Lena Latvine, Svenja Huth, Svendis Jonsdottir, Alex Pop, Ua Pyor, and Eula Brand. Good to see Eula Brand starting. Hopefully, we'll see some of her creativity in the attack along with her pace. As I said earlier, Brand and Jonsdottir are quick and fast-moving players, and I think they will be beneficial in the attack. If the back line is under pressure, if Wolfsburg is needing to play defensively, those two will be able to get back there and support the defense. I'm guessing Tommy Stroop going with Bran and Jansdott here is him going with more speed and pace in the attack, which, it, which looking ahead to Wolfsburg's upcoming games is something that is needed. I'm not sure where Pop is going to be in this match, but if she is in the attack, maybe Pop and Bran will be able to work on their chemistry and work on connecting with one another. I still remember the match last year where Wolfsburg played Meppen. Pop and Brand were really struggling to connect with each other in the attack to the point where it was funny. 
Hopefully they'll sort things out and find one another a lot easier. If not, there's still Pyor and Jan Stottir as well. Now let's get into the first half. All right, so the first half, we are off. Oh, it's my favorite announcer. I'm watching this on Out of Football. I don't know his name, but I recognize his voice. I actually like this announcer. He doesn't talk that much, but I really like his accent. One minute, ball towards the Wolfsburg box. Wilms kicks it back to Fromms. Fromms clears. Pop kicks it straight up for some reason. Wolfsburg needs to control it and not lose possession, especially this early. Essen cross offsides. Like that. It looks like Pop is playing as a defensive midfielder. Two minutes, Jan Stottir foul, tripped by an Essen player, Wolfsburg free kick. Huth sends it in, punched away by the keeper. Essen making a short run, Wilms cuts it off. Three minutes, Essen attempt goes over. Good brand touch. Four minutes, Pyre over to Wilms. Pyre and Wilms struggling to cross, plays it up to Brand. Brand offsides. Five minutes, ball towards the Wolfsburg box. Pop chasing, kicks it back to Fromms. Jan Stottir making a run. Jan Stottir cross, ends up behind Huth, cleared by Essen. Latvine up to Brand in the box, kicked away. Six minutes, Pyre up to Brand. Brand cross, already went over the line, out of play. Seven minutes, Vilms gives it away. Essen making a run, goes out of play. Vilms, what was that? <laughs> Pop up to Jan Stottir, too much behind it, goes out of play. Eight minutes, Brand touch to Pyre. Pyre touch, out of play. Nine minutes, Brand fouls, grabs, spins, and brings down an Essen player. Essen free kick. She's learning so well from Obi. I'm joking, Obi has been on her best behavior so far in the season. Bran is aggressive though. I don't I don't think people notice that. Essen plays it up, Rauch able to kick it wide to Vilms. Good recovery from Rauch. 10 minutes Hagering up to Pyre and Jonstatir, too much behind it. Jonstatir can't reach it in time. Brand to pop, pop over to Pyre, back to pop, pop dispossessed. <laughs> 11 minutes, Vilms cross blocked. 12, 12 minutes, Wolfsburg corner kick, had it away and cleared. Sent back in, Ralph can't get on it, kicked away. Essen player down, she's okay. Wolfsburg foul though. Pyre to Jonsdott here, back to Pyre. Pyre sends it up, goes out of play. Would have been too much behind it for a Jonsdott here anyway. 13 minutes, Latvine sends it into the Essen box, recovered by the keeper. 14 minutes, Pop sends it in, Latvine chasing, picked up by the keeper. Vilms kicks it back to Fromms. 15 minutes, Henrik dispossessed, Essen making a run. Brand cuts it off, great defending and recovery by Brand, even though she takes herself out. Seems like something Pop would do too. <laughs> Pop over to Vilms, can't get open, Wolfsburg recycles the ball. Henrik sends it in, who was that for? It went right to an Essen player. There was no Wolfsburg player nearby or making a run. 16 minutes, pop up to Jonstadt here, kicked away. 17 minutes, Wolfsburg corner kick, misses the keeper. Hagering heads it wide, Hagering down. She's okay, just disappointed. <laughs> 18 minutes, pop lays it off to Jonstadt here, defended away. Ralph cross, headed away. Latvine sends it in for Pyre. Pyre doesn't make the... Um, doesn't make the run, goes out of play. Touch may have been too heavy. She might not have noticed it in time, or it might have been offsides anyway. There's a few reasons why she didn't go for that. Tw um, 20 minutes, Essen free kick, I guess. Not sure who fouled. Ball sent towards the Wolfsburg box, defended away. Lat fine, up to Jans Dottier. Jans Dottier, frustrated, fouls an Essen player, Essen ball. 21 minutes, Hagering under pressure, plays it back to Fromms. 22 minutes, ball up for Jonsdott here, kicked away. 23 minutes, Wolfsburg corner kick, saved by the keeper. Keeper drop <laughs> drop kicks it into Pop's back. Almost went out of play behind the line, but cleared by an Essen player. Yeah, not sure what that was. <laughs> Ralph with the ball, Jonsdott here open and calling for it. Ralph up to Pyor instead. Pyor can't get a good touch on it. She kind of gets surrounded. And Pyre is also offsides. I think Rao should have played it over to Jonstadt here. 24 minutes, Brand fouled, grabbed and pulled down, Wolfsburg ball. 25 minutes, ball in the Essen box, defended away. 26 minutes, Pop, um, Pop literally gives it right to an Essen player. Henrik kicks it back to Fromms. 
great awareness from Henrik that could have turned out badly. Huth brought down, no foul call. 27 minutes, pop over to Huth. Huth trying to get around defenders in the box. Eventually dispossessed and cleared. I don't get why she didn't just cross it in. There were Wolfsburg players in the box. Also, that whole thing, that whole transition was just too slow. 28 minutes, Wolfsburg corner kick smacked away by the keeper, then cleared. 29 minutes, Jan Stottier throws it into the box, defended away, sent back in, saved by the Essen keeper. 30th minute, Jan Stottier gives it away, Wolfsburg gets it back. Rauch gives it away, kind of. <laughs> she kind of just stopped running and let Essen take it off her. Essen making a run, plays it up to another Essen attacker, pop tracking it all the way, able to clear it. 31 minutes, Essen cross headed away by Hagering. Rauch shoved from behind, Essen foul, Wolfsburg ball. Ball up to Pyre in the box, kicked away. 32 minutes, Jan Stottier throws it into the box, Huth recycles the ball. Henrik attempt from distance goes over. 33 minutes, Huth up to Rauch, kicked away. Jan Stottier throws it into the box, defended away. Wilms up for Brand in the box, Brand blocked, can't get on it. Pyre fouls an Essen player. Essen player down holding her foot. She may have gotten stepped on. Yeah, from the replay, she did get stepped up. Um, she did get stepped on, but she is okay. 35 minutes, Pyre fouls the same Essen player from earlier. This time she jumps up and dived over, or actually dived onto her back. It may be because I'm recording this really late, but this is turning out funnier than the match against Meppen. <laughs> Henrik, if you get dispossessed again, I swear to God. 36 minutes, ball up for Jan Stottier. Jan Stottier dispossessed, kicked away. At least it wasn't Henrik. <laughs> Jan Stottier throws it into the box. Latvine unable to get on it, kicked away. 37 minutes, Wilms throws it in. Pyro attempt, hits the side netting. Huth with the ball. Huth collision with an Essen player. Huth down, but the ref is saying she fouled. As in Huth was the one that fouled. Huth not happy. She apparently gets a yellow card for dissent slash arguing with the ref. Since when did they do that in the Frauen Bundesliga? <laughs> 39 minutes, Wolfsburg players getting really frustrated now. Apparently, Wolfsburg foul, Essen free kick, ball sent towards the Wolfsburg box, headed away. Essen foul, Wolfsburg ball, 40th minute, Brand to Latvine, Latvine back to Brand, but misses Brand. <laughs> Good recovery and defending by Henrik. 44, I mean, I'm um, 41 minutes. Essen puts it out of play. Wolfsburg ball. Henrik gives it away. Man, you were doing so well. Kind of. <laughs> Pop chases it down, able to get it back. Essen player down. Ref says it was won fairly. 42 minutes. Brand up for Pyre, kicked away. Pop up to Wilms. Wilms offsides. 43 minutes. Ball towards the Wolfsburg box. Essen offsides. Hagering down after a small knock with an Essen player. Might have gotten hit in the elbow. She's okay, though. 44 minutes, Rauch gives it away. Her and Latvine trying to win it back. Can't. Essen on the attack. Henrik able to get it away. Essen cross. Higgering clears. 45 minutes, Essen attempt. Saved by Fromms. Then whistle blown. First half ends. Wolfsburg, nil-nil. Ja, das ist nicht gut. Wirklich schlecht. Not a good first half at all for Wolfsburg. Somehow, we were able to keep possession and keep control of the game, but it feels like a waste. We didn't really do anything with it. Wolfsburg just looked slow with their attack. We had some chances, but couldn't convert them. We also didn't really create that many chances. Essen's defense is solid, but I think we're moving way too slowly. This match kind of reminds me of the Champions League group stage match last year against Slavia Prague. Slavia Prague is a defensive team. Against Wolfsburg, they were on the defensive. The difference between this match against Essen and that match against Slavia Prague is Wolfsburg kept up their attack, kept pre um kept pressuring, I mean kept pressure on Slavia's back line and were moving quickly. That was still a good match. Slavia's defense was too good. In this half against Essen, Wolfsburg isn't playing like they did against Slavia. Wolfsburg should be able to break through Essen's defense a lot easier than Slavia's, but again, they just look slow. There's also the fact that connection and chemistry just looks off in the attack. 
I was thinking about brands, <laughs> brands um, chemistry and connection would pop, but now I'm thinking about everyone's connection and chemistry. Attacking players not on the same page, mistiming passes, struggling to connect, and struggling to find their rhythm. Wolfsburg needs to do better in the second half. On the upside, defense looks all right. The back line seems to be more alert and focused, which is great. Like I said earlier, just because we need to work on the back line doesn't mean we should be neglecting the attack. For the second half, <laughs> we need to up the pace, be more aggressive, and for the love of Ovi, Obi, <laughs> start connecting in the attack. Let's get into the second half. All right, so the second half, we are off. Pop seems to have moved up in the attack. Maybe there's a formation change. 46 minutes, lap fine to Jan Stottier. Jan Stottier cross hits the side netting. 47 minutes, Rauch up to Pyre. Pyre over to Jan Stottier. Jan Stottier cross kicked away, cleared. Essen cross defended away. 48 minutes, Jan Stottier fouled. Elbow to her back and pulled down. Wolfsburg ball. Ball towards the Wolfsburg box. Fromms recovers. 49 minutes, Wilms cross, way too much behind it, goes over. 50th minute, Jan Stottier throw in for Pyre in the box, headed away. Good defending by Henrik. 51 minutes, Higgering up to Pop, be into it by the keeper. 52 minutes, Hoot to Pyre, taken away. Essen kicks it into the Wolfsburg box, recovered by Fromms. Hoot up to Jan Stottier, taken away. Actually, I think the attack needs to be more alert. <laughs> 53 minutes, Huth to Jans Dottier. Jans Dottier touched to no one except Essen. I think she wanted to play it back to Huth, but again, not on the same page. 54 minutes, pop up to Pyre in the box, surrounded, can't get a good touch on it, kicked away. Brand flying in, Brand attempt goes to the keeper. 55 minutes, Jans Dottier up to Brand, can't get it to Brand, taken away. <laughs> Essen making a run, Essen running into the Wolfsburg box, Henrik defends it away. This, um, 57 minutes, Pyra to Huth, Huth cross, offsides. Essen attempt or cross, hits Higgering, Wolfsburg comes away with it. 58 minutes, pop up to Pyra, headed to Jan Stottier, then cleared. Pyra fouls or offsides, Essen free kick. Essen fouls, grabbing, um, grabs Lena Latfine, Wolfsburg ball. 59 minutes, ball towards the Wolfsburg box, kicked away by Fromms. Higgering shoved in the back, goes down, no foul. Almost stumbled into Fromms. Brand grabbed and pulled down. Yellow card for Essen's Tolon. Essen mistake. Sends the ball into the box while Pyro was there. Pyro unable to get on it. Defended away. 60th minute route up to Huth in the box. Huth offsides. Ball towards the Wolfsburg box. Headed away by Hagering. 61 minutes. Lots of battling in the midfield. Six. Um, Brand fouled. Grabbed and pulled down. Wolfsburg substitutions, Pyre and Brand out, Bramer and Blancfist in. 62 minutes, Wolfsburg free kick, Rauch sends it in, Jan Stottier attempt, wide and off target. 63 minutes, Essen on the attack, Latvine gets it back. 64 minutes, Latvine fouls, pulls down an Essen player. Latvine embracing her in her OB, Essen ball. Ball sent towards the Wolfsburg box, kicked away by Rau. Sent back in, headed away by Rao. 65 minutes, Essen player gets around Rao and runs into the box, but ball goes out of play. 66 minutes, Latvian up to pop, kicked away. 67 minutes, Jan Stottier taken off the ball. Wolfsburg wins it back. Huth cross, pop heads it in. Wolfsburg, 1-0. Finally, <laughs> now let's keep Obi healthy and keep pop in the attack. 69 minutes, ball towards the Wolfsburg box, defended away by Hagering and Latvine. Pop comes away with it. 70th minute, Hagering up to Jan Stottier, defended away. 71 minutes, Wolfsburg cross goes wide. 72 minutes, Wolfsburg corner kick saved by the keeper, but kicked away by Wolfsburg. From the replay, Wolfsburg fouled in the box. The keeper got the ball and Hagering headed it out of her hands somehow. SN free kick. Blancfist up for pop kicked away. Long ball towards the Wolfsburg box. Um, yeah, long ball towards the Wolfsburg box goes out of play. 73 minutes, Hagering sends it up. Essen player can't get a touch on it. Jan Stottier able to put in the goal. Wolfsburg 2 0. 
74 minutes, Wolfsburg substitution, Jans Dottier out, Volter in. 75 minutes, Essen foul, Wolfsburg ball. Ball sent up for Essen, goes out of play. 76 minutes, Rauch dispossess, Essen making a run. Huth late challenge and tackle on an Essen player outside the Wolfsburg box. Huth given her second yellow and now a red. She's coming off, Wolfsburg now down to 10 players. Wow. <laughs> From the replay, you could tell that was late. She didn't get a touch on the ball at all. This was our first sending off this season. I kind of thought the first yellow was stupid though. <laughs> anyway, Pop is now in the captain's armband. 77 minutes, Essen free kick outside the Wolfsburg box. Wolfsburg once again down to just 10 players. Essen attempt from the free kick goes over. 79 minutes, Higgering attempts to kick it away, bounces off an Essen player's back, Higgering kicks it back to Fromms, who clears. So Essen knows Wolfsburg is down to 10, so they're going to try and press higher and take advantage of that. Wolfsburg needs to be careful. 80th minute, Wolfsburg player down, either Latvijn or Pop, Bramer cross recovered by Essen. Ball sent into the Wolfsburg box, caught by Fromms, who takes it to the ground. The announcer was talking about Fromms. He said her jersey when she was younger was an Oliver Kahn jersey. Yeah, the resemblance is uncanny. <laughs> 81 minutes, good defending by Henrik and Latvine. 82 minutes, Blankfist or Volta Cross blocked. 83 minutes, long ball towards the Wolfsburg box headed away by Hagering. 84 minutes, ball in the Essen box kicked away. Um, pop attempt goes wide. Ball sent into the Wolfsburg box, picked up by Fromms. 85 minutes, Bramer attempt blocked. 86 minutes, Wolfsburg corner kick, Latvine header attempt, hits the crossbar. Hagering rushing in to finish it. Wolfsburg, 3-0. Essen player down, trainers out to check on her, not sure if she'll be able to continue. I think she might be getting subbed off. 88 minutes, game starts up again. Good challenge in defending by Hagering. 89 minutes, ball sent towards the Wolfsburg box, headed away. Bramer comes away with it. Ball sent into the Essen box, saved by the keeper. Essen on the attack, goes out of play. <clears throat> 90th minute, Wolfsburg substitution. Wilms out, Wiedemeyer in. 3 minutes of added time. 91 minutes, pop fouls, late challenge, Essen ball. Ball rolls into the Wolfsburg box, picked up by Fromms. 93 minutes, Hagering fouls, Essen free kick. Ball sent into the Wolfsburg box, defended away. Essen attempt from outside goes over. Then whistle blown, second half ends. Wolfsburg wins, 3-0. I can't believe Svenja Huth got sent off with a, a second yellow and a red. I think that was the most surprising thing about this match. That was our first red card this season. It happens to all teams eventually at some points. But of all the players on Wolfsburg, Svenja is probably the last person I could imagine getting sent off. I can even see Pop Brand or Latvine getting sent off before Svenja. Yeah, that was something. <laughs> As for the rest of this match, probably not our best performance. Somehow, despite not playing well, despite this not being an easy victory for Wolfsburg, they still managed to win this match 3-0 even scoring the third goal after being down to 10 players, and also not conceding a goal in the final 13 minutes. That is still very impressive. However, when it comes to performance, it was still kind of slow in the second half. Wolfsburg had the most possession and control in the second half. They were a little more aggressive, but I think they need to turn it up a few hundred notches. Keep up their attack, applying pressure to the back line, and really driving the attack forward. Chemistry and connection between the attacking players was somewhat better in the second half, but again, it needs to be stronger. I'm also thinking Wolfsburg might have been thrown off by Essen pressuring them and putting, putting up a fight in this game, but if that's the case, Wolfsburg really needs to work on handling pressure again and being able to play under pressure. They usually do that pretty well, but maybe they're a little off because the season started up again and this is the second match of the year. 
hopefully they'll be able to get more settled and get their rhythm back as the season progresses. On the upside, defense in back line still looks good. I'm really glad they're improving in that area. But let's not neglect the attack and midfield. We're now heading into the international break. Germany's women's team will be taking on Sweden in a friendly on Tuesday, February 21st. Wolfsburg's next Next match will be the DFB Pokal quarterfinal against FC Kohn on Tuesday, February 28th. Wolfsburg's next regular season match will be Saturday, March 4th against Hoffenheim. That is all I have for you guys today or tonight, and I'll see you all in the next one. Later!